Well, that's just your opinion, man. Hello there, and thanks, Vinny, for a wonderful introduction. And yes, that is just my opinion. You know, I have been the original Amiga user. I mean, this is uh, this was my first computer, right? That's what I meant. Uh, I have been using it with its operating system called Workbench. And the way I grew up with it is that I became, you know, very fond of the user interface. Uh, and I still like it. It has this kind of global menu that you can uh, still see in the Mac computers today. And Canonical attempted this uh, with Unity uh, and their version of global menu. Uh, KDE Plasma also has it integrated, but it's not really enabled uh, in the normal installations. You have to make it work for yourself. Basically, what it comes down to is that you have a window and instead of having a file edit view uh, drop down menus inside the application window uh, when you right click you basically get it uh, on the top bar of your whole desktop for the window that is currently focused this is something that i really like and it might not be something that you would like to use of course this is after all my personal opinion and my personal preference uh, but this is something I would like to see uh, used in the future on Linux. And uh, if you are seeing this uh, footage that I have from my uh, Amiga computer, you can see how, how it works, right? You right click on your mouse and you get the drop down menu of the Windows that is currently focused. But on Workbench, on Amiga operating system, it's not just about the Windows, right? It's uh, like when you highlight an icon, which represents usually a program, then you get a different set of options. You get the rename, you get the copy option, you get uh, the paste option. You can uh, clean up the window if it's a, if it's a drawer, it means a folder. Of course, you can uh, clean up the icons, you can make the window remember its position uh, in terms of the uh, shape and where the icons are located inside it. And all this might be a little bit too much for the modern operating system in 2024, but the basic idea, which I have mentioned in the beginning, is that the main menus of the application should be on the top of the screen of your whole desktop that part i would like to see in the future but if you are a linux user today you can uh, notice that many developers cannot even find a common ground whether to use gtk or Qt. i mean of course the either one has its benefits or cons and, and pros right uh, and i'm not a developer who should judge judge other developers uh, which one to pick but what i am a fan of is universal design right so if um, you know the, the the themes that we have today they are not enough uh, what i would like to see is if we could have just one universal design and many applications that would use it maybe there is another way that KDE and gnome could come to uh to some kind of a common ground that when the developer uh, makes their application that in the end it turns out the same uh, and can be compiled with both widget sets in mind I i'm not sure I, I i don't understand development that deeply but as i said i would like to have one universal language i mean Linux is not about having just one thing. It's counterintuitive uh, <laughs> about free software and, you know, all, all of the freedom, right? But it is something that I would like to have. So the way I can have this today is that I could primarily pick my applications to be written with Qt and avoid GTK applications. This would work perfectly fine for me, but then again, uh, then I would uh, miss out on some applications like maybe Evolution. I use this for work because I need Exchange and that application apparently is the best one for uh, using Exchange email. So if I would skip on that one and use KDE Plasma, it would make me skip an application that's perfectly good and 
actually awesome. So in the meantime, while I am waiting for something to happen regarding unification of user interface on Linux, maybe I can just stick to KDE applications, uh, which mostly serve me fine. Uh, but what I would like to see is that more developers would make their applications compatible with global menu. I'm not even sure how that's called in KDE, but I know it's uh, actually built into Plasma. You just need to enable it. If you are an Amiga fan or maybe a fan of this kind of global menu design, let me know in the comments. I would love to discuss this topic and I'm going to see you in the next video.